one day on the first day of school, one little boy walked into my classroom and he changed my world. He had some specific needs that need to be met and I went from being a general education teacher to being a special education teacher just like that. How long do we have for this? Um, the importance is it is crucial because we used to put our kids, our kids in silos, but now we're coming to find out that all kids have a unique and individual quality in terms of how they receive information and how they express information. What are we preparing these kids for? It's not, well some days it is just this day, mm -hmm. but for long term. Mm -hmm. what, are we, what are we doing for these kids that is going to help them be as successful as they can be after okay. high school? Because it is never too early to talk about transition. That's right. Well, there are a lot of resources out there for teachers, and they need to remember that special education is a team approach. It takes not just the general education teacher, but the special ed teacher. It takes a speech pathologist, an occupational therapist, and a physical therapist all working together to meet all the needs of that student. And there are lots of resources out there available to help those teachers. That it is okay to make mistakes. It is okay to not get it right the first time. If you have the, the heart and the compassion, you'll be just fine, just fine. I think the best tip would be to, to, to step back and look at the whole picture sometimes and not just one specific goal. You might be working on one skill, but in the process of learning that one skill, you're, you may be developing other skills that you don't realize until later. You know, special education teachers, it's a very rewarding job. You go home every day. Those students come to school every day. Everything is a challenge for those students. And if you can do just a little part to make their world better, it makes all the difference in the life of those kids.